What's up everybody? Alphix here and welcome back to more Dead Cells. Today is a uh, is another day, really. It's it's another day after uh, our failures, our many many failures, especially last episode where we died twice, the mostly silly reasons. It's time for some redemption and some fight back. It's time to show the world what we're made of. Without dying in like in the promenade of the condemned. That'd be a fantastic start. Please stop shooting. You're doing way too much damage for my liking. But here we use the the souls like HP regain. Actually got some some health back. Didn't instantly be in trouble. Wasn't instantly instantly in trouble. Uh, speech speech is hard. It's really difficult sometimes. Anyway, um, ah, we are in a let's see our spot. Like, the phaser is okay. Or what, what's it? Yeah, it's still called the phaser. We're dead. We're dead. That's what I get for looking at our at our items in the middle of combat and then coming out of combat completely squished among everything and getting ruined. At least it happened within the first 2 minutes, am I right? Uh oh yeah, I guess we're going tactics. Cuz both of these starter items <coughs> Have a extra, an extra point in the old tactical department. However, we would, assuming we make it farther in the run, we're going to really struggle for health. So I'm not looking forward to that. As since we already struggle as is, uh, you know, to then actually suffer even more. It's not not a great prospect for the future but uh, you know um, it's Wednesday I have a, it's, it's been mostly a chill out, chilled out day the only video I had recorded so far was Streets of Rogue and that was hours ago it's just been chilling I watched the uh, the whatever the riot riots uh, stream that they did with some interviews about the future of their games and some updates and dude riot games popped off last night with like so many new games dude card game fighting game sh first person shooter uh what else did they, uh, an esports manager game which is really hype because i love I like man micromanaging and managing stuff like, for, uh, for example, FIFA career mode. I, I spent almost a thousand hours on uh, FIFA 13 and FIFA 15 career modes collectively. All right, I haven't played a FIFA game since 15, but that's probably for the best seeing as how far down the drain they've fallen. Um, but you know, even though those games, Gave me a lot of entertainment, as well as some frustration, but that's beside the point. The, the ma managing part itself is, is good, and uh, I'm a big fan of that. Ooh, frantic sword already? Yeah, we go with that. We, we make some, expe some, uh, some expenses, some investments. No, that's not the way. But, yeah, now Riot, from a... Just, who used to just be oh they're 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 the League of Legends guys right? No now after ten years of League of Legends they come out with announcements up the wazoo. As I said, card game, fighting game, managing game, first person shooter, and then some mobile ports for both League of Legends and Team Fight Tactics. Um, 
And and I think an action RPG as well, which is also really cool. Um, it, at least they they didn't really go into details about that, but in the little trailer the trailer they showed, it looked like an action RPG, and I do like me some action RPG action. Yes, I do. Um, but the the card game uh, Legends of Rune Terra is now actually available via. Like you can pre-register and get hopefully get an invite, or watch some uh, Twitch streams that have drops enabled. And um, you know, I did that. I, well, you have to you, you you need to have your Twitch account connected to your Riot Games account, and then just watch streams of Legends of Runeterra with drops enabled. And I, I opened like three separate streams. Uh, and just hoped and sure enough I got a drop so I haven't played it yet I do plan on streaming the game I, I was going to do it now but I realized I had to I it, it's not from out of necessity but I wanted to get things recorded for tomorrow at least this dead cells video get it ready for then to go up for tomorrow since it is the first video of the day Otherwise, I would be I would have been streaming Legends of Rune Terra right now. However, if you want to catch my streams, because I'm I'll definitely be playing that, and maybe some Guild Wars 2 sprinkled in as well, uh, you can make sure to follow me twitchtv alfix. Link in the description. Thank you, thank you. Um, while we are shilling, while I'm here shilling, let's also let's not forget Twitter for uh, random updates and uh, notifications for me going live. Twitter.com at alfixyt. If you check me out there, and that'd be greatly appreciated. Anyway, yeah, I'm I'm really excited to get into Rune Terra. I I played a bunch of Hearthstone. Hearthstone was never particularly good at it, but I I think the 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 card game I've sunk most of my time into is um, is more. Like Yu-Gi-Oh! I played a bunch of Yu-Gi-Oh! Uh, not really in in person, by an it could be just simply because cards I never really collected. But I have played it a bunch online on different online simulators, or like not really simulators, but like on websites like Dueling Nexus, Dueling Book, things like that. And uh, also, what's the what's the other one? Ah, we got hit. There, there's one. There's another like uh, sort of platform to play online. It's like Yu-Gi-Oh Pro. That's the one. Yeah, Yu-Gi-Oh Pro. Things like that. I've I've put a bunch of time into that, and uh, that's really one of my played the most. I have played some dabbled in Hearthstone, but I never really got super far in it. But I am I'm looking forward to. Uh, to get trying out Legends of Rune Terra for sure, because um, like it it looks like I after, from the streams and from what I've seen, it looks like a, a sort of a mixture between Magic the Gathering and uh, Hearthstone, more Magic the Gathering like, but there's also there's also some Hearthstone in there, but like uh, just this general. All these announcements from Riot Games are like, I know people are like joking about how Blizzard are gonna be dead. Honestly, like, if they don't come out with some some uh, blistering announcements at BlizzCon, especially, and I mean this wholeheartedly, especially after that whole Hearthstone, Hong Kong, China controversy, I, I'm not going to go into it. But, uh, you know, if you follow eSports at all and Blizzard, you'll, you've probably come across that news. And uh, after that, and you know, some of the last BlizzCon travesty that was the first, the Diablo mobile announcement. Dude, if, if Diablo 4 does not deliver, assuming they come out with that, and if other announcements don't really make any huge impact, I can see a lot of people dropping Blizzard in the near future. 
I know they come out with World of Warcraft Classic and all that kind of stuff, but like, that, that's not enough to keep a fan base engaged. And like, for example, Heroes of the, Heroes of the Storm, they that they dropped all sorts of hype for that game. They completely dropped the esports side of it. They have way less people working on the game, and it's like it's just kind of sad. And Overwatch is pro probably hasn't made as much of an impact as they were hoping for, especially on the esports scene. I'm pretty sure they were hoping that Overwatch League would end up being this huge thing, but it's kind of like stagnant. At least I, th I think it is. Now I don't I don't follow Overwatch League, so I don't really know how huge it is in the grand scheme of things of esports, but. It's like, I'm pretty sure they were hoping it'd be bigger than it is. And then there's like, uh, you know, as I meant, Diablo is uh, in a weird spot. Where Diablo 3 was a bit of a departure from their other games, or from the previous games. And then when everyone comes in expecting Diablo 4 at last year's BlizzCon, they come out with this Diablo mobile bullshit. And uh, everyone hated it. And then, uh, well, StarCraft is just basically dead. I don't know when they're gonna do anything StarCraft related again. Is now they're, they're just kind of, you know, they do have their eSport, but I don't, I'm pretty sure it's nowhere near as popular as the big ones. So, and then the the fact that they're they're. I think it's part partly because of their partnership with Activision, so they get Activision games like your Call of Duties and and things like uh ow the stop hurting me well yeah like Activ some Activision games partnered up with Blizzard and they maybe they think oh well we have Activision games on our client we don't need to be made. Be making our own games anymore or s something like that which is like I mean yeah if they don't come out with something huge this at this year's BlizzCon I can see a lot of people starting to migrate to Riot's side Espe I mean League of Legends is huge as is and has been for years but now with all these new announcements and other genres under the Riot Games banner, it's like, dude, they have something for ev. They're gonna have something for everybody now, not just the mo not just basically the biggest MOBA in the world. I think it's. I don't. I have not heard anything really about Dota 2 in so long. So like, I think. I mean, Dota, I think, is still going. It's just nowhere. It's just not as big as uh, as Lee, in terms of popu sheer popularity. Now, I might be wrong. That might be uneducated on my part, but that's from my, from the way I see it. Uh, but yeah, now card game for the card game fans, management game, like esports management, kind of like. You know, football manager and, and that good stuff. Um, and then, you know, RP action RPG, and a fighting game, a shooter. They just came out the blocks, swinging. Like they, I, they had all of this info and all of this development for years. Just waiting to finally come out with the to to sp spill those beans, and dude, all power to them, man. They made a success. They their first game super successful, and now they're coming out with a barrage of exciting news. That's cool. Obviously, like. The fighting game and the uh, what the other game, the fighting game and the shooter, don't have a real name yet. They're just projects, like 
I think Project A is the fight is the shooter and Project L is the fighting game. But uh, so th th it's they're well off from actually get it coming out to the public. But that Legends of Ruin Terror is the first one, and there's lots more where that came from. Nope. Okay, focus back on this run now for a little bit. Is uh, unless am I dumb? Oh my god, I'm so stupid. We didn't even get disengagement because we died directly. Hey, if this if this costs us this entire run, just from that sheer stupidity of the play. Oh man, what a doozy! Also, use that bow more. Ah, oh, disengagement. I yeah. We gotta heal. Keep our health at a solid spot until we uh, we get this engagement back. Okay, scrolls, much needed power. There we go. Pop, pop, pop. Except yeah, now we we don't have crits on our sword, but we do have uh, the grenade and the aura. To, to help with that, with our lack of strong primary attack damage. And it's not bad, it's still three shots, these guys, and then you drop down, you unleash the last reading aura, which is your big power play. And the, the magnetic grenade for some crowd control, not bad either. Do, 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 do. Nice. All, oh, thankfully that wasn't a pit. That would not have been very well accepted. Give me that full, give me that max health though. Drop down. Okay, you know what, ignore that guy. Let's just move on. Do 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 and I mean hopefully we get far because the Streets of Rogue episode that I recorded today which actually was uploaded today as well it wasn't just it wasn't for tomorrow we made it to the park the, the third sort of hub area or not not hub area but the third biome sort of thing the, the third separate a aesthetic area and then we died on the third floor of that area there was there's still two other areas to go after that, but you know the the more often we can manage to get down down there, the better. And the same thing goes for for two boss cell runs in this game. Like the, the more often we manage to get farther on these difficult runs, the better we're eventually going to get. The more confidence we'll have, and uh, the better we'll be overall. We just need to convert our advantages and sort of eventually weed out the stupid mistakes that have been costing us a lot. Like there, we've been ma there have been some big screw ups that we've made so far. That and uh, the, the, on these difficulties, like there is no margin for error, which is very scary. Oh, food shop. Uh, maybe refill a flask charge for 23,000 though? I don't think we need it. I think we need to actually get some equipment upgrades, maybe a magnetic grenade? Nope. How sad indeed. Sup, brother? Hello. And then you jump up. And you send them. That's not what I wanted to see. Yo, what the heck just happened there? Oh! It, ah! That's gonna hurt if it hits. <clears throat> they got freaking uh, elite sorcerers or aka inquisitors. We got them though. We got them. Hmm. I do like the damage from projectiles reduction though, so this is a sell. 
that is a big sell. I do not want it. Yo, look at that breakage. Whoop. Nice. But yeah, as I also mentioned Guild Wars 2. I'm back into that game again. Uh, from there, there's they have a Halloween Halloween event going on. Haven't really done much with that yet, but I do want to eventually. Maybe in something like uh, you know what I I do like me some some uh, some light speed movement. Even though it's not as good CC wise, it's got so much damage that I do prefer it. Mm. No, you fly! I destroy! You fly, I destroy you. Wee wee. Boop. Nice, okay. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Ah! That's okay, that works. Kinda, I suppose. Wait, did I get it? Fit far? Nope. Oh, we, we, you can roll out of that if you time it right, which is good to know. Ooh! You do not get to hit me. I will not let you send me to heck. Ooh, no, stay up and then drop down and destroy him. That's a good strat. Use your environment to the best way possible. Should be doing that more often, to be honest. Oh, ow! Okay, what well, one hit? We'll we'll allow it. That second hit is uh, is too bad, though. I should not be. Oh, you freak! Thank you for the disengagement. Much appreciated. Now we have crits, and you're all screwed, dude. The, the crits, we love them. What is happening? What well, what are you doing? Okay. Very very well. Going deeper and deeper and uh, oh that's black bridge, isn't it? Big drop means black bridge. Yes, indeed. That is the case. Get me to the teleporter though. We are not finished yet. When we get you in the small pocket, you get absolutely wrecked. Ow! Woo. There we go. Is that a secret? I don't think there is a secret. No, there isn't. I was hoping there'd be a secret blueprint over there but there isn't so it was actually a good use of our light speed to check and then we saw it we couldn't get there so it's all well and good where's the where's the one boss cell door though am I missing something where's the one boss cell hmm Big question marks. Hmm. Well, I, I don't know. So I'm just gonna drop over there and go Blackbridge. Fight. Fight the Lordy. Fight Mr. Concierge. Hopefully, beat him. Uh, how well I do want to keep the cells for the upgrade mm, give me predator uh, yeah give me predator it's not gonna be useful straight away but assuming we beat this guy it will be send me your energy though I kind of need it. That works. 
Um, ah, this is really it's really scary. I am going to pop a heal. Call me a coward, but it was the right thing to do. Stay, you gotta stay in there with the lacerating aura. That's your big, big money. Oh, that's a good way to. Uh... No, we need to pres preserve. Yes, that that's a good way of dodging his shield, his uh, damage aura. Actually, like ah no, boo. You piece of trash. How could you do that to me? Now you get arrowed. No! Oof. Okay. Get farther again, get those crits. You wanna get close? Butch! No, you don't. Ah, you fool. Oh goodness gracious the the pain that he holds Ow Dodge him Get those crits Get those crits Oh he's he, we're fu Ah there you go Okay that that that's this No Whew. I think it's time for the radio silence. No! Ow! Disengagement, thank you. Stay in there. Stay in there while you're disengaged. Do, 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 do. Please, please, baby. You got this in ya. Yes, get destroyed. Oh man, that was. Whew. That was an exhausting fight. Absolutely nerve wracking. Oh. Okay. Can put nothing there, but at least give me. Not as much as I'd like. I was go hoping we could, we would have gotten the upgrade, but that's not on the cards just yet. We're going Stilt Village again because uh, I like this more than Slumbering Sanctuary. And the music absolutely slaps. Oh, instantly cell door. With what? We don't have this engagement, keep in mind. So I probably shouldn't be doing this on the health that I have. I think that was a smart decision to retreat and heal up. Call me a coward, but... I think that was... The smart, smarter play. And throwing knives, that's... Okay, yeah, we we replaced the marksman's bow with that. Ooh, you fool. I know the, the throws are very slow, but... At least, it, I think it is still better than the, the marksman's bow. You don't have to be at a specific distance to get the... To reap the benefits. We got that. Ow, we. Wait, what is? Yeah, it, with a melee strike, makes you invisible. Okay, there we go. We we got some invis. Invis. Set. Ah, you got your knives, I got my knives. What are we getting destroyed by? The poison? I think it was the poison. 
Oh, we got a legendary boy. We got a legendary boy, oh. This is gonna be tough. I'm scared for me life, dude. What is that? Oh, they're elite pirate? Elite freaking pirate. My goodness, this is heck. This is torture and pain. No, wh why do you exist? Don't explode in me face. You what? Excuse me. That was way too much damage. That was way too much freaking damage from that guy. Freaking hell, dude. Oh well. I guess uh, it's time to say goodbye. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed, feel free to click the like button down below. It helps me out a lot. Subscribe so you don't miss an upload. And I'll catch you next time. Goodbye.